Any yeah, of them have spot on your crew member? You can't spot the old, they can't spot the Udes. Not unless you actually push the tanks. Maybe they will do a really super. No, maybe they will just do a super push like with uh, one tank over. Oh, that's very close. That's actually hitting. Oh, oh nice play. They hit him. They caught him. All right. That is a strong play by top tier. They are attacking right at the moment when Rival was preparing to do something about it. And yes, yes, there is the cap pressure. Three tanks currently sit on cap, and it's going to be a lot for top tier to actually this make that This is going to come down to the unknown happen. one. Unknown one has to run the screen like a boss. He needs to stop them from getting through. He's going to block a Kako. Now he needs to block Zit. Zit is going to go for the ram. And now Hakko's just going to push straight through. One, one no, shell. No reset. No be... reset. They couldn't get the lights. And there's that, that's the cap. That should be it. That's it. Well played. Тут вываливается у нас команда НСТ сразу же на Анатолича, вливает ему дамаг, лолшо, биовульф, нужно забирать Анатолича, и Нидин сможет немножечко пожить, но Нидин ушел в ангар, забрал его Кириллой. И просто начинают таять ХП команды Нави, 7371 против 8000, и начинается просто лобовая схватка, тут просто не разберешь, кто кому ломает лицо, минус Рина делает лолшо, Джасткаус уходит в ангар, забирает левша, просто возврат монеты, у лолшо остается буквально 100 12 хп отпускают лолшо, дают ему перезарядиться. В итоге 5-330 против 5-800. Tigers just taking a lot of damage, sticking out, getting the track shot on Commander J. Ventro pushing up onto the Kronvagen, but taking a lot of damage. T1 coming in to try to simp for him. Does block one shot from J Smooth. They're playing it perfectly. They should be able to take down J Smooth. They do. And they know that the Kronvagen's reloading, so they're going to force cap or pressure onto him right now as well. Vetro's low on HP, Knight knowing that, going for the ram. Vetro smartly backing off, and now both the Batchets are reloading, and now it's the Kronzwagen turn to get shots off. At the moment, Kasna crew have three Batchets still on full health at the moment, and Gunners might still survive here. They might still do this, but no, Stefan's got the jump onto Saigo. Ders is charging around in the middle here. Looks like they're going to go after the E5. Ders is going to go after Storm at the moment, and Rico gets the kill on Diplomat. Dares and Storm duking this one out. Dares should win it. One more shot and that'll be killing Storm. And it's go three to four at the moment. What can Artie do? You need to connect the shot. He does! <laughs> Danny there with the kill on Dares! What a shot! I but likely to get the kill on Danny here unless Danny can point blank shotgun him with the Artie. Now Hyba is just a little bit curious. Unji is still not in a position to be able to help Danny. And really, would he help Danny at the moment? Because then Enrico could get jumped on by Stefan and Vetso. Danny sees Hyper. Oh, nice shot, cuts him! <laughs> Danny with the point blank shot into Hyper's face! Vetso takes damage as well from Enrico. Vetso's running. One more shot from Enrico. Can he do it? Unbelievable. Vetso's down into. Oh no! Vetso! What a misplay! You killed yourself down the hill, mate! No! And that's it! That's it! And the kill from Unji! Oh, Gunrunners do it! Gunrunners win that one! 5-2-4! And that, Gunrunners, was well-deserved, lads. He Very well-deserved. just kill himself, man.